Now, after this disastrous outcome, you might think that the government learned its lesson and would probably stop detonating nuclear bombs on American soil, at least for the purposes of natural gas mining. But that wasn't the case. They went on to do it two more times all with the same result. This is Project Gas Buggy. By the early 60s, the United States was facing two competing pressures. On one hand, energy demand was rising rapidly. Natural gas became critical for heating, generating electricity, and industrial use. Conventional drilling reached its limits in certain regions, especially in tight sandstone formations where gas existed but couldn't flow freely. On the other hand, the U.S. government was sitting on something unprecedented, a fully operational nuclear arsenal backed by thousands of scientists, engineers, and physicists who spent the past two decades proving that atomic energy could be controlled, scaled, and deployed with precision. So they came up with an idea. If we can use nuclear explosions to blow up the enemy, why can't we use them to mine natural gas? 